Thrifty Tiffany and I am back with a multiple store haul. We have Trader Joe's, we have Target, we have Aldi, and we have Dollar Tree. And I am so excited to be here with you guys today. I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. If you're new, I hope you stay and subscribe. And if you're a current subscriber, thank you so much. I appreciate y'all's support. If you haven't yet, check me out on TikTok and Instagram at ThriftyTiffany35. I would love for you to join me over there if you like my content here. You may like it over there. So we are gonna jump into this. So this is a bit random. I bought a lot of things for our Halloween gathering that we're gonna be having on Halloween. Again, I have three teenagers if you're new here. Um, 18, 17, and 15. So we're just doing a little gathering around the house. They can have friends over and I'm, I'm gonna make some charcuterie boards and just have a good time. We're gonna play some games and just kind of make it just a chill, relaxing, fun time. We might do like where everyone wears like Halloween pajamas or like a onesie or anyone can dress up, wear a mask. However, they can, however. But I wanted to share with you guys some of the grocery items that we got from Trader Joe's and um, just some random items from Target, just from all these stores. So sit back, grab you a drink, and just let me show you what these stores have to offer right now. So you will see a theme here. Again, I'm gonna be making several different things. So I'll just tell you about it once I show you those items. So we're gonna start with Trader Joe's because girl, I love Trader Joe's, love them. So I started off with the big French baguette that we always get when we go to Trader Joe's. The kids love this bread. We usually get one or two, and they'll eat them today. They'll eat them by the evening. Um, so I grabbed one of these. These are really good. Warm up, warm up, wow. <laughs> I can't talk. Warm it up in the oven, and it's absolutely amazing. Of course, you guys know I can't have this bread right now, but they can eat it, and it's so good. Look at it. It's so good. So I grabbed that. Now, I'm going to be making a dip that I saw on TikTok. So uh, for Halloween, the dip is like cream cheese on the bottom. Then you put a can of chili on top of the cream cheese. Then you put shredded cheddar cheese on top of that and bake it. And then you dip it with like Fritos. Okay, well, Trader Joe's has organic corn chips, organic corn chip dippers. And these are, these literally only have three ingredients. That's how like, look at them right here three ingredients. So instead of Fritos, I got the organic version and I thought it'd be really good because I'm so excited for this dip. I think it sounds absolutely amazing. And with the um, cheese on top, it'll just look real Halloween. So I'm so excited for it, but I got two bags of these organic corn dipper chips, basically Fritos. Um, so I grabbed those, so excited for that. I grabbed Cash some candy that he can eat. He loves these dark chocolate sunflower seed butter cups. They're like a Reese's. They don't taste like a Reese's, but they're like a Reese's with sunflower butter in it. Um, so I always get these when I go to Trader Joe's. He absolutely loves them and asks for them every single time. Kaya got her some of these. Um, basically, these are a Trader Joe version of Takis, um, and they're really good. She loves them. They're really, really good. Uh, then we got these crackers for the charcuterie board. These are red chili scalloped edge crackers. Um, they look so good. Look at these. So I wanted to try, and these were like $1.49. Y'all, if you've never been to Trader Joe's, definitely find one in your area because the prices are so affordable. So affordable. I got these little peppers for the charcuterie board. I love these. These are great to dip in absolutely anything. Hummus, cream cheese, whatever type of dip that you want. Ranch dip. These are really, really good. And the colors... I can pull the orange ones out for Halloween or the red, just make it really, really pretty. I love these sweet mini peppers. They are so, so good. I got my favorite shredded carrots. I just like to keep these on hand because I make lettuce wraps like all the time. So I love to keep those on hand. And I got some more. I know I just hauled in my recent Kroger haul avocado spray, but I love the Trader Joe's version. And I go through this like crazy, so it's not gonna hurt me picking up a couple more. I literally love their version and I love their version of avocado oil. So I just scooped all of those up. It will all get used. Um, then I decided we would try, we love Sriracha in this house. I mean, we go through it like crazy. Cayman and I love it, but they have a Trader Joe's version of Sriracha. So we are gonna try that. Have not tried that one yet. I got my favorite little skinny green beans. I love these. I love eating these lunch. 
They're good just like this, or if you saute them, they're so good. So I picked those up. And then I got two of these shots. They're Trader Joe's Organic. I am obsessed with um, like healthy immunity shots. These are actually no organic, no joke, ginger juice shot. This one has coconut water, ginger, lemon juice with cayenne pepper. Um, and these are actually cheaper than the other ones that I bought. These were $1.99. The other ones are almost three bucks, depending on what store you get it from. But I cannot wait to try these ginger shots. When you take them, you almost just feel immediately healthier. <laughs> it feels like it's like burning everything out of your body because the ginger and the cayenne, I absolutely love those. And my kids have been sick before and I just stay on my vitamins, stay on my juice shots and thank goodness, thank goodness I haven't gotten sick yet. But okay, here we go, here we go. Now I kind of picked these out, they're tempura shrimp. This looks like the shrimp that they actually put in sushi, but it looks so good. So she picked these out and she picked out this also a pizza. This is the uncured pepperoni pizza. So I'm gonna run out of space so quick. And then I got my favorite maple chicken sausages. Y'all, these from Trader Joe's are so good. They get a little bit of sweet. Again, it's maple chicken breakfast sausage. Love these, love them, love them so much. Then I got some smoke-eyed salmon. And this one looked really good. It's hot smoked and it's got crap, cracked pepper, mustard seed, and lemon. It just looks absolutely amazing. So I had to pick it up had to pick it up and then i got some of the columbus peppered turkey breast i love these for like my lettuce wraps or if i just need some protein really quick um just grab a slice of this it's really good the columbus brand is definitely a good brand if you see it out and about grab you some i got cream cheese two cream cheeses from trader joe's for that dip that i'm talking about the again it's gonna be I'm, i'll probably film it it's a it's a tiktok recipe but i will probably definitely film it so let me show you. Also, we're gonna have chocolate hummus on one of the charcuterie boards with like strawberries and stuff. So I picked up the chocolate hummus. It's really, we've tried this before. It's really, really good. And then I got onion chive cream cheese spread. I actually got this to have with the salmon. I'm not quite sure. I might just like spread some of this on the salmon, roll it up because I can't eat bagels and stuff like that. I might eat it some type of, some type of little thing like that. But cream cheese chive so good and then this is the mozzarella balls with the seasoning this is what you dip the the baguette bread in or you can also put this on a charcuterie board it's really really good it's so good y'all and i've seen a lot of other stores start carrying this so you can find this at walmart kroger places like that y'all my hair is i have it in a bun it's looking a little crazy sorry so that is Trader Joe's. Let's go ahead and stay with the refrigerator stuff and I will show you all the, I only went in to grab like a couple items and I also went to find a small pumpkin. I need like a small pumpkin so I'm gonna go to Kroger to get that. I need it for like one of the charcuterie boards. But I got the cheese for the um, chili dip. I'm so excited for that dip, the chili dip. Let's see what else do we have over here. Then I grabbed some turkey sausages Okay, so one reason I went to Trader Joe's is because they have a turkey summer sausage, and I went to get that, but they did not have it. So these are turkey sausages from Aldi, and I can chop these up and put them, or leave them like this and put them on the charcuterie board. Also, I love creamy pepper jack cheese. I love these little triangles. This is gonna go on the board. All different kinds of cheeses. I love smoked cheeses. So I got smoked cheddar. And this I've already had. I had it at Christmas time last year. So good. Definitely recommend. And this smoked Gouda. Smoked Gouda and smoked cheddar. Literally the best ever. And then I got two cans of just original chili. No beans. You can have beans or no beans. I just thought for the dip I would do a no bean type situation. So I just got two of the chili with no beans. And then I found two beautiful candles. And of course I got them because of the color. This color is my everything. And it says number 18, I guess is the name. Number 18 and the scent is wild fig and red berry. Now at the first scent of it, it kind of smells weird. But then like when you go away, it smells really good. So hopefully it smells good when it burns. I haven't decided if I liked it or not. 
but I got two of them. <laughs> but anyway, we'll see how we like those. Okay, literally I have everything everywhere. Things are gonna fall. So we'll go into Target real quick. Let me just show you what I got from Target. I had to get some more mouthwash. This is one of my favorite mouthwashes. This is the Thera Breath mouthwash and I love the Healthy Smile and the Fresh Breath one. These are more expensive than like regular mouthwash, but I, do, I absolutely love these. So I'm always getting these when I go. CVS sometimes has a sale on these, so check that out if you're wanting to try it. I picked up some Sensodyne Extra Whitening. I am obsessed with Sensodyne now, so I got that. And then I also got the kids like the Colgate Optic White. So they have these two packs. This is a two pack as well. So I grabbed those. I just picked up some good old shaving cream and this is the shaving cream at Target. That's a dollar. It's just regular old shaving cream. I meant to grab some when I was in Dollar Tree and forgot. And then this is the Honey Pot Sensitive Foaming Wash. Pick that up. And then I grabbed, oh, what else is in here? Oh, get more candles from Target. I needed to re-up on candles, y'all. I am completely out, surprisingly, completely out of candles. This one smelled really good. It's oats and honey. This one smells, I love that smell. I love that smell, oats and honey. And then I grabbed this one. This one is mandarin, mandarin berry. Really nice. I needed, I, I need to get more candles. Like I needed to re-up. I was completely out of candles. And fall and Christmas is the best time to have your house smelling really good. And this one is apple acorn. Never heard of that, but it smells like fall. Apple acorn. I love apple cinnamon, y'all. I love it, love it, love it. Then at Target in like the dollar section, y'all, they have these little throw blankets for $5. This is just as one count cozy throw blanket. Look how cute this is and like luxury it looks. You could put this in a gift set for Christmas time and with a can, like say the oats and honey. Like look how good that goes together. Oh my goodness, so cute. But I got a little beige one and then they have this really pretty red one. Like how stunning are these? Five bucks, five bucks for these. That's about the price the ones at Walmart are. I think the Walmart ones are like eight. Um, but these are soft and like actually luxury feeling. And they were in the dollar spot for five bucks. Had to pick them up. Those are amazing. And then Kaya picked these out for her room. She wanted some more LED lights. They sync with your music. I think these were like 10 bucks and she, we got her two boxes to go all around her room. But they sync with your music. And it has like a little remote and everything. So I grabbed those for her. Also, so Halloween, we'll probably be playing games and stuff like that. You know, just have a fun time with teenagers. We have the game Incoherent. We have Jenga, um, Uno, regular playing cards, and then Connect Four. Y'all, this actually can get really, really fun. So if you sit down, this is like, this is very competitive. Um, so we got Connect Four. I'm so excited for this. So we actually, where do we see? Somebody playing this on TikTok, I believe. And I was like, you know what? I haven't played that since I was young. So I picked up a Connect for them. Like we can play that. That'll be so fun. So fun. Okay. So now some Dollar Tree items. This is not like one of my huge Dollar Tree hauls. These items are just what we got for Halloween. So that's why I wanted to share them with you guys in this haul. But I went to pick up two of these because if you guys saw my decorate with me, I hung my skeleton up right here on the bar area, but my happy Halloween is that bright orange. So I thought I would get two of the pumpkin heads. These are like the little things that hang. So I got two of the pumpkin heads. I'm gonna hang them up on each side so it just goes together. So when we take pictures on Halloween, it'll look really pretty. Um, so yeah, I got these. These are so cute, y'all. And they're only a dollar at Dollar Tree. They only a dollar. So I got the pumpkin heads. What else is in here? I picked up some gum while I was there. I got Big Red, Extra, and Spearmint. Y'all know I'm always picking up gum. And then here we go. So, let me tell you my idea about this. The, all these charcuterie boards. So, the deal here is I'm going to be making a fruit one, a meat and cheese one, a dessert one, and then a veggie one. So, I'm going to have my bar with all of those different charcuterie boards or I got a really large one up there, like the big circle one that I got, I'm gonna put several on that. I'm not sure how I'm gonna do it exactly, but I've been on Pinterest like for 
for days, weeks, just getting, you know, ideas. And um, so on one of the charcuterie boards on Pinterest had a skeleton dead in the middle, right? That was in the middle of it. And then they had all the desserts and stuff around it. And you can like put the skeleton however you want it on the board, like lay its arms and legs all going crazy and then put food all around it. But they had the perfect skeletons for it. So I got these two skeletons, they're big, and I'm gonna put them in the center of that big wood charcuterie board. And then I'm gonna put the food all around it. Like how cool is that? I'm so excited, like I'm so excited. And I also saw um, like where if you wanna make food webs, like if you wanna um, make like spider webs over like fruit or something, you can use marshmallows and melt them or a marshmallow fluff and melt it and like string it like this all over all crazy and look like a spider just put a web on it. But anyway, I got both of these and so I'm gonna be making, I cannot wait to show you guys that. I'm gonna be making charcuterie boards with those. And then the reason I needed a small pumpkin, this, is, this has been around for a long time, but a small pumpkin, I'm gonna cut it out and make a big circle mouth and then put the ranch dip coming out of the mouth so it's like throwing up. So I was gonna do the veggie platter with the little pumpkin throwing up the ranch dip. I thought it was so funny. That, that's so cool. A lot of people have like guac coming out of the mouth, but I'm gonna do a ranch dip. I thought that would be really, really fun. So I did that and then let me show you, I still got more stuff from Dollar Tree. I picked up the wheat thins, which I love, or thin wheats from Dollar Tree. These are so good. They taste like wheat thins, y'all. Perfect for charcuterie boards. So I picked those up. Also, I already have the Monet crackers that I always buy, the entertaining Monet crackers. I already have a pack of those. I hauled those in my last haul. Then we got candies. We got Reese's. These are for like all the friends and stuff to come over. I don't know if we'll get trick-or-treaters. We're in an apartment. Who knows? I got Hershey's. I got, y'all, I stocked up on all these candies. I got Milky Way with salted caramel. Then I got, we got Crunch Bars. Then we got, I'm trying to find another one. We got Three Musketeers. And I have to get a lot of these that Cash can have, you know, without nuts. And then the Twix, he can have those as well. And then we got Kit Kats. And then I already have bunches of gummies and those fruit chews. And um, we got little bags of chips like Pirate Booty and um, Cheetos and stuff like that. Then I got these blow pops. I got the regular blow pops and then the lemonade stand blow pops. And I got how to get classic candy corn. Y'all, I actually like candy corn, but I can't eat it right now. But you gotta have candy corn because I'm also gonna put some of these around the charcuterie board, the sweet treat one. So I got that. And then I got, what else? Snickers. Kaya picked up the Snickers. So then we got Snickers too. We got so much candy, so much candy. But that is my haul, y'all. I do have a couple other items in my room that's like for my main Dollar Tree haul because I'm already buying stuff for like my main one. But I think I have some like snacks that I got um, in there as well for Halloween. But this is the main little, I'm getting ready. We're getting ready to get this thing on the show on the road um, of this little Halloween gathering. I'm so excited. I love doing something for every holiday, y'all. Every holiday, I love it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Maybe it gave you some inspiration. Go to Trader Joe's, Dollar Tree, fix you a little charcuterie board. Definitely check out Pinterest because they always have the best ideas and it just sparks, you know, it in you to just make up some new stuff. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed that and stay tuned because I will be doing a video on that little dip, that TikTok dip. And then when I put together the boards and all of that, you know, I always film that stuff. So that will be coming up. But I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. It's Sunday. Y'all relax before the start of the week. And I will see y'all on my next video. Bye, y'all. Love y'all.